No right. Don't no get back. I'm power stroller. Oh, 525. The mean old man got down. That's because you down here in my damn radio, and I'm just a man that don't give a damn around Lafayette, Louisiana. Hey, uh, 525. You heard your friend that break? Yeah, I just gotta... I just got to get down to where I got to point my antenna after I twist it around with the new rotor and all that there, Brian, Brian. Ten four, ten four. well, you got it twisted in the right damn spot if you ask me, Doug Lugger, because you got my radio leaned over. Choke, come on. Hey, T-Bone, just real quick, what do you think about the audio? Well, you know what I'm running, and you like it there, Brian, Brian? Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. It sounds freaking awesome, man. It sounds freaking awesome. Leave all the knobs where you got them at. Don't touch a damn thing on that radio. That thing sounds superb, that breaker. Yeah, I appreciate it. The only thing I did was take off the noise canceling microphone, and I'm working to turn it across the two there, Brian. See what happens. Boy, that duck lover sounds good. And, you know, I got the gate rolling, so you'll be able to see, man. No doubt. I just sent you the other little snippet uh, from before, but... uh. I got a little gate roller right down, so you'll be able to see how it's sounding with that turn up plus two, but I love it. I do a hey, choke T-ball right back. Yeah, I love this 80-footer antenna. I love this 80-footer antenna. And the other thing that I had, I should have got rid of that other one years ago, but I, you know, you know how it goes. Hey, T-ball, look at old 525, and I'm taking my time. How do you, how do you? Hey, T-ball, I'm going to take my time with this gun bear. Cause I like it, I like it, I like it. From what everybody's saying, they said 525, don't touch a thing there, baby. Oh, that's the best you sounded in a while, that, that choke, no doubt, man. That is the best you sounded in a while. Don't change a damn thing. Look at what you got there. Take a damn picture where you got them knobs right now. Just in case so they get bumped, you can put them back where the hell they had they'll break. They ain't gonna get bumped, I'm the only one here. Hey, T-Bone, they are not gonna get bumped. I am the only cotton picker here, dear baby, baby. But if that buffalo start bucking, man, it might hit that radio, man. If that buffalo start bucking, it's gonna throw you off, you're gonna hit the radio, and then you're gonna bump the damn knobs on that end, and you ain't gonna remember what they had there, break. Yeah, right. Hey, uh, T-Bone, on that echo, I don't have too much, do I? <laughs> nope, just right. Just right. Just right there, choke a chain, they'll break up, break up. And okie dokie, mighty fine, now I can get my white ass from underneath my bed. I'm gonna go fishing, I'm gonna go fishing. <laughs> I'm gonna go fishing, hey, hey T-Bone. Look at old 525 checking out this stuff there, break him, break him. Well, you can go fishing if you want. You can go fishing if you want, but I damn sure ain't going out with no damn hurricane out there in the Gulf. Nope, I will stay myself right here at home, and I'll be a porch honky. I've been known to sit on my porch all day long. Oh, choke T-Bone right back. T-Bone, what you telling me? What you telling me? You be afraid to get on a lake? Or your little pond over there. Get a sailboat. Get a sailboat. You're going to save on gas. You won't have to fire down the motor. And get out there and do a little bit of fishing. That wind will push you up around there, Brian. Right, right. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can go in the lake if I want or something like that. Yeah, I can do that, but I'm not too much into that, man. I like to go hit that go, hit that salt water and catch me some duck looking red fish. So this duck looking here, they'll break. Yeah, I want to catch me a fish. I'm going to catch me a real big fish real soon. Real soon, and then I'm going to stuff it with a whole... Nah, I'm not going to start that. I got to go catch me a buckeye mud duck T-bone, baby, baby. Well, you know how they say, hey, you know how they say that choke chain? Do what you do, but watch my shoes. You can get loose, but watch my shoes. Hey, choke, do what you do, just watch my shoes. <laughs> I don't wear shoes. I like stomping on people's head barefooted. Yeah, but that got to hurt, man. That got to hurt, man. You stomp people's head barefooted, that's going to hurt after a while, man. And then you're going to end up... uh. You know, with a boot on your foot, because, uh, you know, you're going to end up bringing a bone in your foot, stepping on people here barefooted, they'll break. You got that right. The last time I hit a cotton picker in the head with my foot, my 
barefooted. You know what that son of a bitch started doing? He started sucking my toe there, Breaking Bread. Oh, that ain't never good. That ain't never good. Man, you say last time you, you stepped on the cut because he is barefooted. They started sucking on your toe? Oh, I don't want to know no more. I don't want to know no more about that. You're right. I'm going to stop it right there. I'm going to stop it right there. All right, T-Bone, I want to take a listen to it. I don't know if you're recording or not, but you said leave it alone. I'm going to leave it alone. I'm going to leave everything set right here. It must be that West Side 80-footer antenna. That's what it must be. Hey, T-Bone, I'm ready for these cotton pickers now. That was my test. That was my test with that other cat picking whatever they call him, the two chain chain, uh, some lip sucker or whoever that was that way. Oh, you know I got a gate rolling. You know I got a gate rolling. We going we could we could just call it the uh, five twenty five talk show that break. Yeah, until the boys try riding me. Until the boys start riding me. You know, speaking of riding, I, I'm gonna go horseback riding. And I got this cowgirl. This cowgirl wants to teach me the right way to ride a horse that break Well, well, maybe you'll learn the right way to ride a horse, man. Maybe you'll learn the right way to ride a horse, because, you know, how you ride that buffalo ain't how you ride a horse, they'll break. Well, they're telling me, that, that, that cowgirl's telling me, there's a way you ride a horse, and then there's a way you ride a white buffalo, they're breaking, breaking. Yeah, I don't know nothing about that, man. I don't know nothing about that choke chain, because I don't ride horses, and I don't ride buffaloes on this duck plugging in. I ride the cows, they'll break them. Oh boy, I bet the cow's testicles ain't big as big as my buffalo's testicles there, baby. No, no, if I fall off the back, I just I just let the cow go, man. If I fall off the, off the back, he buck me off. I just let the cow go. I get up and I dust myself off and I go get me another damn cow because they only got to buy 300 of them out there, they'll break them. <laughs> you're a mess, A.T. Hey, Bone, you're a mess. But anyways, I think I did my checking out. The new antenna seems like it's working. West side specifications, brand new everything. I got uh, no reflect. I got a 1.00 SWR, best that it ever been. The other time around, it wasn't all that great. You know, these cotton pickers, boy, I'll tell ya. Hey, T-Bone 525 is brand new antenna. Brand new radio got all the way down. Well, I tell you what, that duck plug is sounding good, man. That thing sounding damn good. That new antenna, that new radio, no doubt about it, man. That 350 built, that damn thing sound damn good behind them eight element beams on that duck plug and then no doubt, hey, choke yo, man. That don't give a damn round left yet, Louisiana. I told you, come on. Here I am, man. I appreciate it. I know what it sounds like, but I'm gonna hear it. I'm sure I'm gonna hear it very shortly. Simone, all I gotta do is just you set everything alone. I have a tendency to put my mouth like right over here, or else right over here, T-Bone. Hey, T-Bone, just, does it sound good right there, or should I run it about that? I'm, I'm just moving the microphone up to my mouth right there, buddy, buddy. Run it right there. Run it right there when you put the microphone up to your mouth. Look like you might have been letting go of the key there. You kind of unkey, keyed, unkey, keyed right there. But no, just like you got it right there when you put that microphone up to your mouth, man. You got some hella modulation sounding damn good there, Breaker. All right, I might have been letting go of the key. AT-Bone, I got it right where you said it. I got it right where you said it. I'm about three inches away from this turn of plus two there, bam, bam. And that thing sounding damn good. Don't change a thing. Super glue the mic right there where you got it so you can't move it. Then just stay three inches away from that duck plugger. And then take all the knobs on the radio. Super glue them duck pluggers too. And don't move them damn things. Hey, 525, you mean old man. You heard your man that don't give a damn. I'm right back. Come on. I heard what you said, I heard what you said, I heard what you said about three inches away. You know, that brings up a story of mine, T-Bone. When me and this girl were doing our thing and I kind of got up, she said, Hey, 525, do me a favor, just move three inches back. Just move three inches back and let it go there, baby. Well, you know, you know, I one time, man, at one time, man, 
Uh, you know, I tried to give a girl three inches she didn't want it. She said she wanted six, man. So I had to go back, give me some popsicle sticks and stretch that duck plug out there, break. <laughs> All right, we're going to let that one go. We're going to let that one go. <laughs> I was going to say something, but I'll keep it. I'll keep it. I'll keep it to myself. Hey, T-Bone, you wanted a little bit of a 525 talk show. I'm trying to do the best I can with what I got. Right here, right here, right now with this brand new beam. This brand new beam and 350 audio. That very very Oh, you doing it in fine style, man. You doing it in fine style. It's a, it's, a, it's a 525 talk show, and you doing it in fine style, sounding damn good in T-Bones town. Hey, uh, now all you got to do, man, all you got to do now is chill in the AC, sit next to the CB, and get out here and do your duck-looking thing in the world of sound. Hey, choke T-Bone got down. I don't need an air conditioner. T-Bone. T-Bone, when I woke up this morning, it was 39 degrees, Ken Bear. It's only 52 now. All I got to do is open up my window, and it's like air conditioning, bam, bam. Oh, that's right, that's right. I forget where you live, man. See, we, we still got the air conditioner running over here on this duck looking in, because if not, it get out in the house, man. We still got the air conditioner running. I forgot you live where y'all get four foot of snow on that duck looking in and all that good stuff like that. So you just open the windows and you uh, let the house cool off that duck plug way. See, I forgot about that. Well, look, then just do this, man. Just open your duck plugging windows, let the cool air in, sit down in your chair next to the damn CB, and key your mic and get in where you fit in that choke chain. I rephrased it for you, they'll break. I do every time I key it down. Hey, T-Bone, I do it every time I key down. I get in where I fit in. But all these boys, <laughs> all these boys are finding out that 525 is not really a joke, man. I just play with them and call rope with dope, and I give them something to talk about. I give them something to talk about. I key down a technician. I did this. I did that. <laughs> Hey, T-Bone, I'm going to give you a little bit more. It's going to be all over for these boys. And I had a little bit more to go. I had a little bit more to go. I just wanted to see where that man wanted to take me. Ten Tenfold, tenfold with having a little bit more to go, man. Tenfold and having a little bit more to go there, no doubt, man. It's fun, man. Get out of here, have a little fun, man. Play around a little bit there, no doubt about it. It's all fun. You said you had a little bit more to go, but you just wanted to see where you wanted to take it there, no doubt. Hey, choke chain. I heard it when you said it. Yo, T-Bone, I'm back out. Come on. Yeah, it's all right, T-Bone. Hey, T-Bone, I'm going to end this little talk show to T-Bone and 525 show right here, right here, right now. I did what I wanted to do. I checked out the antenna. The antenna is great. It's running high in the sky. The radio's working fine, and it's a cool day in Buffalo, New York. Hey, T-Bone, like I told Tony Baloney, <laughs> oh, Tony was full of baloney in 806 or whatever you want to call that cat and bigger. I had, I had just a little bit more to give him, but he didn't want to stay in the game. That's what you call about what kind of amplifier you built, and I built my own T-Bone, but poor Tony Baloney. Hey, T-Bone, whatever happened to Tony Baloney? Oh, well, Tony was in the fight at first, man, until 86-0 jumped up in there, and then, uh, oh, 86-0 started climbing up in there, that you and him went at it there, you know, so, uh, I don't even know if Tony was still firing down, man. I don't know if you were still firing down tonight, because old 86 0 had a hammer out there, you and him, man, and y'all did y'all duck look at thing they'll break him. Well, see, that's what I'm talking about. Why run? Why run like a little girl? You stay in the damn fight and get your ass whooped. Well, see, Tony ain't like that. Tony thinks he's going to keep on getting out there and whooping everybody, whooping everybody. Well, Tony got a little taste. Tony got a little taste of 525 of what he can do. <laughs> well, that's why I said Tony is just full of baloney. But anyways, that'd be a friend of mine. Everybody always wants to try the technician. Hey, T-Bone, I am the man that just don't give a damn. The original 525 is a mean old man. And they also say the choke just ain't no damn joke. T-Bone, Mr. 525 himself. Adios, cha 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 cha. 
working this brand new beam. It ain't no DVI, it's another brand new beam, 80 footer, and I got down. Yeah, you get down and fine style, there's no doubt about it. But you already know that there. Hey, hey, Choke, you already know. You're a duck looking technician on that end, and you build dams and everything, so you already know. Them boys are gonna come out there and test you when they hear your station, man. You already know this, I ain't gotta tell you, as you build them amps and all this and that, man. So you know them boys are gonna get out there and try to give you a hell of a run for your money, they'll bring. Yeah, sure I am. Sure I am. Hey, T-Bone. Hey, T-Bone. Man, this is only my damn driver down there. That's why I can get so goddamn long with it. Those boys got hell when I hit that fiddle, uh, 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 T-Bone. Hey, T-Bone, that's why I say I always got a little bit more, but I just haven't had that competition yet. T-Bone, your friend, 0525, the master technician of the four CX-800s. A little bit of screaming bias in the morning will do you great. Hey, T-Bone, and that Watergate. And that damn Watergate T-Bone, because I want to listen to it. Bone there, bigger, bigger. I'm going to end it right when I get off the key. I'll let you return one more time. I'm going to end it when I get off the duck plug and key, 8525. Come on, end it for me, and I'm going to hit the end button there. Come on. Here I am, T-Bone, just a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. Hey, T-Bone, put it on your here, dab later, my brother. 0525, T-Bone Talk Show. There ain't nothing. I ain't gonna say nothing. I am the man not to be played with. The original 525, the man that just don't give a damn. Working this great big old white buffalo. Talking to the man that don't give a damn in Louisiana. In Manchuckin, Louisiana. Manchuckin, it don't friggin' matter where the hell you will, T-Bone. Hey, T-Bone, 525 is a mean old man. Brian, Brian.